analog clock reading, minutes. We see here a big red clock. Do you know what time it is? Well, the little hand is at the nine, and the big hand is almost to the one, which would mean it's almost to the five. But let's count the minutes right here. This is one, two, three, four, and then five, which means it's pointing right at the three. So this clock says it is nine, oh three. Let's try another one. Now we see that the little hand is by the eleven, so we know it's eleven something. And the big hand is down here, almost to the five. Now do you remember what the five stands for? Yes, twenty-five but it's one right before that. So subtract one, and that would be 24. It's on the 24th minute, which means it is 11, 24. Let's try another clock. The little hand is almost to the 12, and the big hand is somewhere in between the eight and the nine. So we know it's still 11, okay, and the 8 represents the 40th minute, and the 9 represents the 45th minute. Now this is pointing to right in between, right? So this is 40, 41, 42, 43. It is 11, 43. One more clock. Now we see that the little hand is at the eight, or almost to the eight, and the big hand is just past the eleven, which means eleven represents the fifty-fifth minute, and it's one past that, so one more to fifty-five would be fifty-six, so that means it is seven, 56. If it were 856, this can be tricky, this hand would be more towards the 9. So that's why it's 756. Great work, and I hope to see you again soon.